What if I told you there was a man who, outnumbered and outresourced, still managed to wage a war against one of the most powerful empires of his time, and even came close to victory? This is the story of Hannibal Barker. Born in 247 BC, Hannibal was the son of Hamilcar Barker, a revered Carthaginian general. The young Hannibal was steeped in the art of war from an early age, and his father's fierce opposition to Rome kindled a similar passion within him. Hannibal's rise to power was marked by his determination to challenge Rome's dominance, a task that seemed insurmountable given the strength of the Roman Empire. Yet his strategic genius and audacity were such that he refused to back down. Hannibal's mission was not one born of hubris, but of a profound belief in the potential of Carthage. With his ragtag army, he embarked on an audacious plan that would shock the world. Imagine the impossible task of traversing the freezing, treacherous Alps with an army and war elephants. Yet Hannibal did just that. Now let's delve deeper into the genius of this Carthaginian commander. Hannibal's crossing of the Alps was a breathtaking feat of strategic planning. He led an army of 40,000 men and 37 war elephants across this formidable mountain range, battling harsh weather, hostile tribes and treacherous terrain. Once in Italy, his brilliant battle strategies continued to shine. He used his elephants, a foreign and terrifying weapon to the Romans, to break the enemy lines. But Hannibal's genius didn't stop there. He was a master of deception, luring Roman legions into carefully laid traps. One such ambush at Lake Trasimene led to a catastrophic defeat for the Romans, with Hannibal's forces surrounding and trapping them in a mountain pass. Hannibal's mastery of strategy and tactics were unparalleled, putting the mighty Roman legions on the back foot. Despite his eventual defeat and Rome's survival, Hannibal's strategic genius left an indelible mark on military history. His cunning tactics, innovative use of resources, and relentless determination in the face of overwhelming odds set a new bar for military strategy. The protracted war he waged against Rome was not merely a testament to his personal resolve, but a reflection of his deep understanding of warfare. Hannibal's strategies were not confined to the battlefield. He knew that war was a test of endurance, a battle of wills. His focus on breaking Roman morale through a scorched earth policy across Italy was a masterstroke, disrupting their economy and sowing seeds of discord among their populace. This Carthaginian general's genius was not in his victories, but in how he prolonged a war against a superior adversary. His strategies have been studied, emulated and admired by military leaders for over 2,000 years. Even in defeat, the legacy of Hannibal Barker's strategic genius continues to inspire and instruct military leaders to this day.